Hello folks, this is V for You Radio. I am Anupam and bringing you another business forum. Today I'm so privileged and honored to have our patrons, a business couple from Edmonton, Goldie and Priyanka Mathur. Both of these individuals have been a great supporter of this channel and of course have been doing great in the fields of finance. They are leading insurance, mortgage, RRSP, RESP providers in town. So today we got a chance to chat with Goldie Mathur and Priyanka Mathur. Goldie ji, welcome to the forum. Priyanka ji, welcome to the forum. Hi, Anupam. Hi there. So um, the purpose of this, Goldie ji, is uh, to, to chat about what's going on in the Canadian domain. We know that the interest rates is the talk of the town. Inflation, the recession, the job losses. Again, Canada has been struggling. We, we as individuals are struggling and looking ways to really keep up with such pressures. How would you, what's your take on it as a, as a business owner? Uh, I handle it and I tell my clients very simple things because uh, I ask everybody the very same question. Uh, did you bring recession? Did you bring interest rates higher? Or anything did you bring or were you the cause of int high interest rate, inflation or recession? No, a common person is not has not brought that. It is just a financial cycle. And I'm not trying to be an expert to say it's a good or bad cycle. What I educate people on very simple things. What is the thing right now with your paycheck coming in home? What are the things you can control to keep more money in the pocket and take the advantage of higher interest rate, inflation and recessionary times? So my job as a licensed advisor is to show people and educate people in what they can control and not focus on what the things they cannot control. So this is my take on it because inflation goes up and down. Recession comes and goes, right? Interest rates goes up and down. That's a government policy. I can't control government, but as a common person who works hard every day, what are the things they can control? And I help the families in what they can control. So this is my take on it, Anupam. Absolutely, did I agree? I mean. It's a common saying, control what you control and do not worry about what you can't control. And within that also, Goldie Bai, I, I agree that there are so many ways people can empower themselves by surrounding themselves with, with people like you, subject matter experts, and getting the knowledge and trying to equip themselves. Um, this is the season, I mean, when uh, I want to, first, of course, uh, do a small little disclaimer to my audience as well that this is today whatever we discuss of course this is uh, purely uh, from the opini opinion of Goldie Mathur Priyanka Mathur it is not an opinion of me for you radio because they are the they are the experts in this in doing so uh, what I wanted to also tell uh, Goldie ji that whenever we come across it's like every year this this is the time when we start talking about thinking about some of the tax saving strategies and. Just in the in the benefit of our audience who is listening to us today, uh, I wanted you to share some of your personal experiences with my clients as a licensed professional. What are some of your advices? How would you like a person uh, to 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 look at some of the tax tax uh, strategies and what are the some of the tax strategies which which people can can utilize, especially in this tough time when. We've got pressures from all sides, which could be inflation, could be interest rates. So, uh, Goldiji, please uh, apprise us with some of some of your uh, experience in this field. Yes, thank you, Anupam. <clears throat> Finance is a very simple thing. All these major institutions have made it very complicated. We make it. We want to make it simple and easy for people to understand. A common person should understand, and housewife should understand. A common man who doesn't have the education about the finances should, should understand. We focus on solutions on each family. And we simply say, we observe a technique called KISS. I'm not going to kiss any client, but KISS technique is keep it simple, stupid, right? Finance is keep it simple, stop it, uh, keep it simple, stupid, right? Now, but when I say that, if somebody wants to save taxes, my first question is, do you exactly know? How much taxes do you pay? And if you want to, if you don't even know how much taxes you are paid, because see what happens in February, you pay taxes February and March when you do the taxes and then it's done, right? But do you know how you can save on taxes? 
you you just mentioned a, a vehicle called RRSP, right? My question to you is, is why would you do an RRSP? Is it really right for you? Because everything does not fit everybody, right? So what we do is, is we sit with the clients and explain them whether you should do an RSP or you should not do RSP. Because see, our focus for the clients is education about a financial tool they'll be using. Because see, I know RSP is not the best. RSP is not the bad thing either, right? But what we educate them on a very simple discipline called a savings discipline, right? What is a short term thing and what's a long term thing, right? Most of the people come through Google to me. They're very well educated about finance. But when you ask them a very simple thing, like I'll mention it to you, do you know how to read your statement? They are not aware of even how to read the statement. So my duty as a professional is to educate them. Can you read your own statement? Let's go to the basics. Keep it simple, stupid. Case, I always say, case strategy in finances will make you rich. And that's why we are here as licensed professional to make it simple and easy for the people to understand what is available for them, whether it suits their needs or not, right? Because one size does not fit all. Like your clothes, one size does not fit all, right? So we cater to the needs of the people and that's how we approach any of the take tax saving strategies. Wow, great, great way to... I like the word KISS principle. Um, audience always likes to make it simple. See, um, it's 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 the simple things which attract us more than making things complicated. And folks who are listening to us today, we are talking to Goldie Mathur, Priyanka Mathur on some of the tax saving strategies. You heard the word RRSP, which is Registered Retirement Savings Plan. And these folks are specialists. He mentioned about showing a way to, to read your statement. To be honest, I also don't know how to read a statement. Goldie, Goldie if I were to ask you, how much time would you take to me to explain my RRSP statement? How much time would it does it take you to explain to me? Okay, so the first step is a lot of people say, you know what, I'll take a picture of my statement and you tell me about that. That's a big no-no. Why? I ask them, if you are serious about keeping more money on your pocket, and I'll say it again, if you are serious in keeping more money in your pocket, then we should meet at our office. We provide no obligation, no commitment, 15 minutes to 30 minutes of their wow. time wow. and educate them about their own statement. Because see, if I tell you somebody came with $100,000 and they said they had a great rate of return, <clears throat> but there was a, a simple bracket sign on it. And I just asked them, what does that bracket mean? They couldn't answer. And when I gave them an answer, they were saying, oh my God, I was with those five big banks. Nobody told me how to read the statement. And I say, keep it simple. Understand <clears throat> how to read the statement. And approximately it takes 15 to 20 minutes. You can come down to the office. Coffee is on us. Tea is on us. Hot chocolate is on us. We make it simple and easy so that people understand where they are today and where they want to go. That's the key here. Finances is very simple. Everybody should know. So uh, you brought a very good point. Folks, first of all, understand, nobody else can think better than you yourself uh, thinking about yourself. This is what I heard uh, Goldie saying, telling us that he would empower us. Today is the, is the, war, is the time when we want to be empowered. We want to be educated. We just do not want to follow someone, but of course, create those strategies with a meaningful, thoughtful, uh, thoughtful insight into it. And it looks like Goldie and Priyanka both invest time with, with their clients, with their friends in explaining what's best for them. If people were to come to your office, where are you located at Edmonton, Goldie? We are very, very strategically located in central Edmonton. If, if you are in Edmonton, if you know White Mud, we are located right at the White Mud and 98th Street. You, we are just three or four minutes away from Southgate Mall. You can reach us if you can drive. There is ample of visitor parking. If you want to come by bus, the bus stop is in front of our office, right? Train, bus, if you want to drive your car, everything is very easily accessible. We are very centrally located. And you know what? Sometimes 
in the worst case scenario when somebody was unable to have a ride we have actually picked them up from the lrt station in few cases just to help that family save their own monies because it's everybody's hard earned money i don't become smaller if i go and pick somebody wow. so we do those exceptional things also just to say it's your hard earned money please protect it nobody will educate you or project protect your money we will just provide you education and you will get empowered and then you can make your choices so very well said and i heard something you said that uh, you you do some small small things uh, they're not small actually and i know you'll hate what what i'm about to say to my folks because they have seen us together before as well and and as much as you have asked me not to talk about it but folks if you remember this is the same couple who's who i introduced you as saying that a couple doing ordinary things into turning into extraordinary things and this is just when we think about donations uh, we think about money first and this is the first couple i met who is donating blood and i remember we we covered a story for you so goldie bai you are doing some really love, wonderful things but i'll 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 switch my my question to priyanka priyanka i know that um, v for you radio has got four pillars and i've been really talking lots of good things about the pillars because that that's the inspiration how why i am i am attached to it and I, and this family v for you family is growing the the four pillars are all around global social issues one of them is of course women empowerment girl child empowerment you are in the business and you are doing some excellent things teaching people not just registered savings plan but teaching how to save for the kids teaching them some insurance benefits and all that today we'll talk about rrsp which is the registered retirement savings plan can this empower women priyanka certainly anupam ji it can uh, empower women because i would like to say that gone are the days where women were considered as having a lower income in the family now in the family there are ladies there are women who are higher income earners than their male counterparts or there are many single women who are in the high income bracket so once you are in the high income bracket you um, by default come into the high tax paying bracket too so you could use rrsp as a tax saving strategy at the same time you are saving for your golden years on which you don't have to be dependent on anybody how would you feel that throughout the life you are the women earning a lot and when it comes in the retirement you have to be dependent on on somebody or some uh, a uh, government benefits or something so rsp can help women empowerment in two ways while they are working it helps them in save taxes and when they are not working in their golden year it helps them to be an independent person in the golden years too and have a healthy comfortable retirement so that's No, what very I well said. I purposely brought brought this one. I also agree that we still are living in under some narratives, and of course, this is one way to shatter those narratives. You rightly said, women leadership has been astonishingly coming up all across the globe, and we, I, I personally love to see uh, that that they are certainly getting empowered, but not just making sure they are they are contributing towards the econ the, the household economy and all that. However, the knowledge in how to sustain it and how to stay independent uh, is very important my eyes are actually going behind you priyanka <laughs> the trophies the shining trophies and all that what are all this all about what what where did you earn this and tell me something something about, about the trophies uh well anupam ji you are very observant and uh, well these trophies i just earned by help ping other people save money and uh, mm. uh, get the better uh, what you say options for their money and uh, better <clears throat> investments better insurances because people just tend to go to one way like if it's an investment or something <clears throat> they just follow all the way to the bank and i had a couple uh, today 
who stayed with me who had come for one thing and they ended up staying for three hours and they ended up doing three or four things wow. so they just came for one but they had rsps done resps done and they asked me do you have somebody else coming i said no why uh, i am giving my full time to you they said yeah because when we go to the bank they always say oh we have the next appointment we have the next appointment so we are not a transactional we don't follow a transactional approach but we follow a educational approach wow. so because of that um, i was uh, honored by some of these cups and trophies and uh, all this uh, most of it the credit goes to uh, goldie because he brought me into this business and he paved the way for me to do this so that's it very well said I mean of course uh, you can both both acknowledge each other i'm i'm sure that both of you are helping each other out in building such a solid strong educational relationship oriented business uh, we can go on and on goldy coming back to you there there has to be a reason why we are discussing our rsp on 31st of january is there a deadline something which people should keep in mind uh, and 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 so that they are able to make take the maximum advantage of this uh, of, of this product right i believe in very simple thing if you are really serious in keeping money with you and not letting people take money away from you in the form of taxes i'm not against taxes why would you wait till the last day right, right. i can show you by different strategies within inside of our rsps right that you can keep more right but if you come to me on the last day and i'm being very practical and realistic and say oh you do it you rush it right i don't want to rush somebody's hard earned money because they have earned that money over the whole year and they want to see it with me and know about the options so that we can decide properly rather than rushing in the last moment i want to give them the best value for their money because i say only one thing you guys have been trained to work hard for your money i want to just show you how your money can work harder for you so that both of you win you earn money by working hard let me show you how your money can work hard so yes officially i would say march 2nd okay but i have all, all my clients all our friends come well before like we are getting busier and busier every day because i educate clients why would you do in a last minute right because right. there are many strategies if you don't have the money i can help them with rrsp too right Absolutely. there are, there is an opm opm strategy which we can talk of later on if you don't have the money you can still do the rsp and get the advantage of it right there are some different programs on it right so if you have the money yes i can help if you are doing a rrsp through your work yes i can help right so those strategies are very powerful and if you come to me in last minute last day well i won't be able to give you the best value so 30 minutes of my time is complimentary to everybody complimentary means i don't charge anybody to sit with me talk about the strategy and there is no need that you have to stick with me but i will educate because that is being ethical and professional to educate somebody and let them make the decision we don't force anybody to make the decision that if you have come come to me and do the business no get yourself educated empowered and then choice is yours because that's a fair way of doing priyanka bought a very wonderful time a wonderful quote here saying we are not transactional people it's not a traditional transactional approach we are doing we are doing an educational approach so 30 minutes any time 24 hours a day 7 days a week 365 we are help to educate people about how they can keep more in their own bank accounts rather than giving it to somebody Well said, uh, both you and Priyanka, um, and of course, time for sense. I would do not, do not. I, I, you know what? There's so much I want to talk about, and so much hidden secrets which I want to really. I've heard the word opium. I know you have purposefully talked about. Of course, folks, it's not that opium which which you may have taken in literal sense, but uh, there's something which uh, which uh, Goldie is wants to talk. Last thing I want to touch and and uh, to to all our listeners. um if and if that's okay with you uh, goldy and priyanka that we want to do a few episodes of this so that we are able to really bring back 
uh, and not give everything to the client. Keep it simple, stupid kind of thing, which you said, uh, so that they can digest and then wait for the another episode. So, folks, we will be doing three to four weekly episodes. On um, in this episode, we just touched base. The, it is just the tip of the iceberg. What's going on? Who should invest? How uh, do Priyanka and Goldie bring bring up uh, uh, everyone to speed? How do they empower? In my next episode, we will cover a few benefits and we'll go a little bit deeper, a little bit wet. We'll wet our feet with the product, specifically the product and how it can help each individual. Because as, as, as rightly you heard that it is not one fit for all. It has to be customized. It has to make sure that it meets your, your situation. Last but not the least, any one, one advice you want to give out to, uh, to uh, my folks today in regards to, I heard that Priyanka said that, hey, when, when people go to bank, I've experienced it myself. They are always saying, I have another appointment waiting for me. What is one thing different you are going to do when I would approach you um, so, and with that, I would probably um, like to wind up our today's show, but Goldie, back to you, just one thing. Okay, I would ask you one thing. If you have a kid, right, who can take care of that kid in the best possible way, mom and dad or a bank? I'm not against bank, right? <laughs> would you be interested in making an educated decision <clears throat> or do you want to make an uneducated decision? We are based, we deal with our clients or any friends or even unknown. We say, make any decisions which is educated. So our approach is an educational approach, not a sales approach. I'm not looking for your business. If you give me the business, I'll be very thankful. But have an education, feel comfortable that you are doing the right thing. And I'm on your side of the fence because I don't have the quotas. I don't have the targets. I am for you on your side of the fence. So deal with the guys who are ready for giving you education without obligation and any commitment. What so I heard was two things. Different. What I heard as two things. One, as a parent, you you were bang on. I've got a son who's 20 year old who is already eligible to invest in our recipes. And guess what? If I give him some tips, right? I am. He would not follow my advice as much as, yes, I would follow. He would like to sit with a professional. These kids are so um, smart, I would say, for their for their money, for their age. They really want to make the right decisions. So, of course, what I heard is if you want to make kids financially independent, financially educated, it, this is the time to have them sit in front of professionals rather than trying to answer all the questions. So that's one thing I heard loud and clear. And, and and also uh, saying that, yes, who can do the best, think best for them? I think the parents. Parents always like to think and take the best decisions. They want to make sure that they're in the right hands. So with that said, I really thank both of you for joining we for you Radio Business Forum, talking about a product which is very, very important for, for, the, for the Canadians. Uh, this is one of the important tracks to strategies, one of the best times to think about this product line. And especially as we started this, this whole discussion, we are operating in tough times. My heartfelt thoughts to those who are struggling. I know, I know that people are affected with the inflation, with the job losses, with the interest rates, and people want to be in front of professionals like you. So thank you so much for, for coming on my show. I will bring you back probably in a week's time. Until then, goodbye and best wishes. Thank you, Anupam. You are doing a great job for bringing such a show which empowers and educate average Canadian, every mom and dad who work so hard get educated so that they can keep more. Our logo is keep more in your pocket rather than giving it to somebody. So thank you very much, Anumam. You're doing a great job. And we thank B for you radio as well for that. Thank, thank you, you both. Before you, radio. Before you, radio. Kabhi bhi.